Are you looking to add bots into your Discord server? Well, you have come to the right place. At the end of this video, you'll be able to add bots into your Discord server within a blink of an eye. And if you don't believe me, make sure to keep watching. However, before we go any further with the video, I'm going to need to ask you guys something. Make sure that you've liked the video and that you're subscribed to the channel, as only 9% of you guys who actually watch my videos are actually subscribed, which is pretty crazy. For those of you who are new here, I post Discord videos twice every week, with a bunch of content still planned. So make sure to subscribe, else you'll be missing out. Also, be sure to look out for the animal somewhere in the video, and the first person to comment it down below gets a shout out. Alright, let's move on to the video. Discord bots are a pretty helpful tool for your Discord server. There are tons of different bots available, which offer a wide range of features. If you want to know which bots to use in your Discord server, I suggest watching my video on the top 5 Discord bots, which will be linked in the description below. Now, you can do this method on all devices, as I've tested it, and it's the exact same process. So all you need to do is open up a web browser, such as Google, and then type in top.gg. Now this website is literally the hub of Discord bots. You're able to search for any bot category, or any bot name. You can also find bot features by just searching which feature you would like, such as counting. If I type that in, you'll see all these bots here have something to do with counting and they give a counting feature, so it's pretty cool. You can also see there are lots of different tags which you can explore if you're not really sure which bots to use, so you have music, moderation, new bots and there's obviously lots more that you can look through. So we're going to look at the top Discord bots and you can see it gives the number of servers the bots active in and been used in and then it also gives the rating of the bot. So once you've found a bot which you want to use, all you need to do is click that bot. So we're going to use Dankamima for an example. And as you can see, there is an invite button right here. If you happen to be concerned if the bot is actually any good, you can see there is a rating which it provides, as this bot's had nearly 2 million votes in January, and it's got a 4.7 rating. So I can see it's pretty good. It also provides a description of the bot if you're not really sure what sort of things it provides. It gives a prefix here, and it also gives you the website sometimes, which you can easily use for the bot. As you can see the rating here, this is provided by real people who are actually voting for the bot, so you know it's good. So once you're ready, all you need to do is click the invite button and it'll take you to another tab. And as you can see, it's saying, do you want me to connect this to my Discord account? Make sure you're signed into the right account and then you want to select the server which you want to invite the bot to. So in my case, it'll be Fleet's Fantasy. I'm gonna press continue. And then this is all the permissions which you need to give the bot, so in order it can do different features which you want it to do. Now all you need to do is scroll down all the way to the bottom and click authorize. Then you've got to do the verification, which will probably take me ages. Oh, there we go. And there you go, thanks for adding Dank Mima. Now you can see this is opening a website. Some bots do this and you can see the different commands, different things like socials which the bot uses. So you can find a little bit more about the commands on this website to make it a bit easier for you to use the bot. Now, if we go back to Discord, and you go into your server, so it's over here somewhere, here we go. You can see in general, the bots join the server. Dank Mima is here. Now you can do this again if you decide to add any more bots into your Discord server. So see, how simple was that? Thanks so much for watching the video, and if you made it this far, be sure to join my Discord server, which is in the description below. See you guys in the next one. Bye!